Hey, what's up, everyone? It's Hatton Gamer here, back with another Fortnite Battle Royale video. Before we start, if you guys want to enjoy the video, please leave a like and subscribe. Share with a friend, or two, or four, however you wanna, however many people you wanna search it with. Anyway, I meant share it with. Anyway, let's get into this video. So you got the loot of Lazy Links. So basically, this is another other loot of video. I think I did the loot of Salty Springs, Snowy Shores. Maybe I. I did flush factory, yes, I remember that. I think I, this I think this could be the fourth location, I don't, I'm not sure. So, I think I should just get straight into it. I got my list right here. So, in terms of traps that you get, first of all, you get one mounted turret, which is key. Like, almost all, almost any game that I win, I usually use a mounted turret. You get a campfire and a launch pad. So, in terms of traps, there's no spike trap, but the mounted turret makes up for that. So this is the average of loot that I got over playing 20 games in Lazy Links. Being either the last one standing in Lazy Links with all the loot, or le just landing there alone. So basically this is the standard like average of loot I got. Grey weapons. You got 6 normal ARs. Which is just a bit too much. You, you only need 1 AR. So 6 of them... <laughs> I mean if a squad lands there and you spawn 6 of them, that's fine. You've got three pistols, which is just a standard pistol, not anything you know, like different, just a standard pistol. Two tactical shotguns, and six grenades. Y yes, that's right, six grenades. And grenades are very key. I usually don't pick them up when I'm playing, but sometimes I, I'm like, I wish I had grenades, you know? They're very key. Green weapons. You've got three normal ARs, so just half of the... Half of the grey weapons. You got three normal ARs. You got three pump shotguns. That's a that's a good thing. Like if you have, for example, duos, you and your partner both will have a pump shotgun. Maybe if it's a squad, you know. And uh, you got one tactical shotgun, which is nobody uses the tactical shotgun. Like nobody does. And you got two SMGs, such as standard SMG. You got three mini shields. Two medkits, which is good because medkits are also very key in this game. You get one six shooter, which is trash. It's just a trash weapon, but <laughs> you got three dynamite, which is alright, I guess. Three dynamite is not that bad. And now I'm gonna move on to blue weapons. In terms of blue weapons, you have one normal AR, one burst AR, five shield pots. That's right, five big shield pots, and you only need two. To get to max so if you have like three mini shields and five big shield bots that's a lot of shields if you have one six shooter again bit trash and the heavy ar which is the best ar in the game like without a doubt so yeah next you got the purple weapons you got three stink bombs which are key like, a lot of these items are key but the stink bombs are really good because like if someone's hiding in a one by one you can throw a stink bomb in there to force them to come to you and you've got four slurps, that's right, four slurps, and, on, and one only heals to 75. So, it heals 75 shields, but prioritizes health as well. So that's key there, four slurp juices. One pump shotgun, you've got 20 balloons, so two packs of balloons, 10 pack, you know, like one pack and one pack, each is 10, so 20 balloons. You've got one thermoscope they are, and currently with the exploit that's going on, this thing is is very overpowered right now. You got one scoped AR, just a normal scoped AR, which again kind of works with that exploit, but the, a thermal is like better. But you hardly find it anyway. You got gold weapons though now. One silenced AR, one gold burst AR, so one for mass basically, and one chug chug. Now I wanna say something before in this video. If you drop lazy links by yourself, it's not likely that, likely that you will find this loot. But I dropped 20 games to see the average of loot that I'll get. So if you drop just one game, it doesn't mean you're going to get all this loot. You could, but it's highly unlikely. But if you drop a lot, you might get something close to the loot I got. Maybe it's just my luck or something. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, as I said in the start, please leave a like and subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you all guys next time. Bye.